Welcome back, Southwest Florida. You are looking live at the Cape Cod Community Foundation's generous Cape reception here at uh, Palmetto Pine Country Club. It is a beautiful setting, a beautiful evening here, and Lee Pitts Live is here to document this spectacular reception. Big shout out to my man, Taurus Pugh. He's on video and camera tonight of you a star photo booth. Right here is Dana. You've seen him on the show before. We're going to rename this show Dana Live. How about that, Dana? I like it. Dana does, uh, let's get that uh, br brunette, right? Brunette, yeah. Dana does an outstanding job as the uh, chairman of the board. Yes, sir. For the Cape Core Community Foundation. And he's also very instrumental in a lot of the things that he's done in the Cape in the past. Does a lot of with the uh, Florida Gulf Coast. Uh, Small Business Administration. What's that? SB something something. SBDC, Small okay. Business Development Center. <laughs> okay. And uh, so we're just so thrilled to get him here. Uh, first of all, um, Dana, um, this event right here, it looks like it's shaping up to be a wonderful affair. Is this pretty commonplace for the Cape Cod Community Foundation to put on receptions like this? Yeah, we do a few a year. Um, you know, we always like to shine the light on people who make a difference in our lives, and, and this is one of those evenings. Um, it's so many people are doing so many things behind the scenes, you want to make sure that people hear about it. And sometimes it's something that's happened recently, and sometimes it's a, it's a lifetime achievement. You know, there's a lot of people here in this community who've been instrumental in, in really building the foundation for Cape Coral mm -hmm. over the years. And, you know, we like to make sure that they get recognized. And also the nonprofits. You know, this is what it's all about. You know, helping nonprofits, helping them grow, making sure they're getting access to funding and learning the things they need to learn to uh, to be able to grow and be effective in our community. How would you describe the reputation of Cape Coral Community Foundation in Southwest Florida? Uh, has a lot of respect. I, and I think it's growing. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we uh, we uh, like everybody else when there was a downturn in the economy. You know, we had to slow down. But since then, we've, uh, we've been able to, to grow uh, and add uh, great board members. And we brought on uh, Michael Chapman, who you know very well, mm -hmm. uh, who's done an, an outstanding job. The president and CEO. Yeah, and he, um, he's, he's done a great job of getting us back out there and making us relevant again. Let's go ahead and elaborate on Mike a bit. People saw him on the television show a couple of weeks ago, along with you and um, uh, what's the other guy named? Joe. Name? Joe. Uh, but um, it do, you say he's getting you guys out there. Hey, Leap is live is sitting here right now. Leap is live would not be sitting here right now without Mike bumping into me in the public and, 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 and seeing that vision and mm -hmm. say, hey, why don't you come out to the reception? Of course, I was glad to come out because uh, I like working with you guys. You guys are uh, uh, you know, one of my great uh, connections now to uh, start seeing what you guys are doing. So you'll probably see me trailing around at a lot of your events in, the come, in 2019. That's great. This crowd here tonight, uh, generally, who are these people? Um, a lot of people from Cape Coral, they've been involved with the foundation over the years, whether they be on the board or supporting us. Uh, there's people here from other uh, uh, foundations, other nonprofits who we've uh, benefited and who, you know, who do a lot of work in the, in the community. So this is, this is a night for us to come together mm -hmm. and, and recognize some people who've made a difference uh, and also to shine a light on, on the education that we do uh, and helping other nonprofits. So we, uh, when the program started, we would get additional education about what you guys do as well. Yeah, you're going to hear about that. You're going to hear about what uh, the, the people we're honoring tonight, uh, about you know the contributions that they've made. Um, and and, and it's, it's important. You know, it's important that you shine the light on these people uh, and understand that, you know, they're doing this of their own volition, their own time. You know, no, nobody's getting paid for this. Right. You know, so it's, it's, it's good that these people step forward and, and do these things. Tell me about the name Generous Key. What's that? What are we... When you hear generous Cape, you're to think what? For me, it's about, you know, generosity. People think about generosity, it's a, it's a money thing. It's also a time and talent thing. And a lot of these people do just that. Um, yes, you know, money is, is, is important because, you know, it makes the, makes the wheel spin around. But, you know, people volunteering their time, sitting on boards, you know, going out and, and doing things uh, in the community. You know, generosity is, is, is many things. And, and to us, it's important you know to celebrate that that's excellent well it's been a pleasure having you stop by here we're at the reception phase of this event we're going to move into the formal phase as the night goes on what do you have a particular role here tonight on the program yeah i'm, I'm kicking it off i'm uh, kind of the mc to get things rolling and then uh then we'll uh pass it on to a few other people uh 
as the evening goes along to, to introduce uh, some of the people we're honoring. Mm -hmm. You got a, a, some uh, award recipients tonight, honorees. Mm -hmm. Not to mention them all, but who, who, who stands out to you? Who, you know, who has a great story in terms of their work with, you, with your foundation? You got a one that you like? That's uh, tough. A met That's or tough. something? I mean, you know, the easy answer is all the above. <laughs> okay. Well. You know, but you have you have people there who've had who've been you know committed to this uh, organization for you know its entire time. You have uh, Ivan Gore has been around since the beginning. I see. You know, uh, David Gomer again, uh, a guy who's been around since the beginning. Uh, you know, and then we have people who've come along with us. Uh, you know, as 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 the long journey has come along. Uh, Steve Pullman uh, is being recognized tonight. I used to work with Steve at the city of Cape Coral. He's now retired. Um, and you know Elmer Tabor. I mean, you talk about someone who's a historian about Cape Coral. He's one of the original people here in town, and the stories he has about the people and the history of Cape Coral is just tremendous. You I see that? You get it all right here on Lee Piss Live. We're gonna get to know more about a lot of these recipients tonight. Hopefully, we'll get them all to come through here. You know, usually people like this are sort of shy, but uh, we'll get them to talking on Lee Piss Live. We'll be right back with more Lee Piss Live right here at Generous Cape. Uh, reception uh, that's taking place. We'll be right back.